Hey viewers, it's Samantha again. Um, I just wanted to make a video response to Cute Witch 772's video, Leaving Christmas Behind. She made this last year, I know that, but I really, it really hit me. Really, I, I can definitely relate to it, and I wanted to make my own video about that, and I'm just going to link it to hers. If I could figure out how to do that, I told Mark what I would do that on the last one until we couldn't figure it out again, even though I've done it before. Um, I'm terrible, but anyway, um, but I, I agree with, with Kara, um, I'm having a lot of problems getting into the Yule spirit, and kind of leaving Christmas behind, as she said, um, my family, my entire family celebrates Christmas, and they're not exactly accepting of me being pagan anyway, so I find it really hard to get in the Yule spirit Especially because I think the I, I like I want to be in the Christmas spirit, but it uh, at the same time it's like it's hard to explain. It's like I'm into the idea of Christmas, but not the meaning behind Christmas. You know, the Christ and Christmas thing. Um, like you know, I love the tree, which I would have done a Yule tree if it were my house, and I were decorating it anyway. But I love the tree, and I love you know just that everyone's so excited and they're in such a giving mood, and you know they say. They, they link their mood and their spirit to Christmas, whereas I would, you know, I would prefer to link it as Yule, but I think this time of the year for all religions is just a really special time of the year, because there's just so much good energy and so much, so much positive thinking for this time of the year, and everyone's so giving and generous, like I said, but I think the biggest thing, I ha the biggest problem I have with leaving Christmas behind is the music. I'm a very musical person anyway, so... When I'm trying to, you know, think Yule and be high-spirited, it makes me want to, like, sing. But I don't have any Yule songs. If you know of any, you should link them to me. But anyway, um, you know, I know all these Christmas songs, and I've been singing Christmas songs. It's not like I think I should be only celebrating Yule and completely ignore Chris Christmas. It's not like I'm really freaking out being rigid about it or anything, but I'm just... I would love to, you know, Yule is, it, it's special to me, and like, like Cara said, when it's on paper, I realize how big of a deal it is, and it's something that, I'm, that it really resonates with me that it's, it is a big deal, it is very special to me, it is a very important Sabbath, Sabbat, whichever one you say, and I just really want to appreciate that in the time, like in the time frame, in the season when I should be more excited about it. I just feel like I'm not as excited as I should be because I'm caught up in Christmas. And when I do kind of start feeling myself getting excited about Yule and, you know, I'm getting in the spirit and everything, then, you know, everyone else around me is uh, celebrating Christmas, which I'm cool with. But they they get, like my family, for example, they're, they, almost, they almost mock me over Yule. You know, I, I gave my parents, I gave my my parents, and I haven't finished writing the cards yet, but I, um, I'm writing everyone Christmas slash Yule cards, and, um, when I gave my mom hers, she got really upset, because it said, Merry Yule and Merry Christmas, and she, she said it upset her, because she didn't want to be reminded at this time of year that I wasn't a Christian, and that really hurt me, because she won't listen to me, this video is taking a turn, I didn't mean for it to, <laughs> but she won't listen to me about my my religion and what I'm doing, my past. She won't listen to me about any of it. She just says it's bad, says it's wrong, and you know that I'm going to hell and all this stuff, which I think is really terrible. I really can't stand that when people have absolutely no tolerance and they don't even want to hear what you have to say on other matters outside of what they believe. That really, really, really bothers me. And that's just a big problem. But anyway, that's not what I meant to do. I do not mean to rant here. Um, another big problem I have is I'll say Happy Holidays instead because I may celebrate Yule, but I'm also going to celebrate Christmas, like I said in the last video. But, you know, I celebrate Yule. I know other people celebrate Christmas. People celebrate Hanukkah. People celebrate Kwanzaa. You know, there are so many different um, religions and different holidays for this season. So I'll say Happy Holidays. I'm a cashier at an office store, office supply store. And I'll say happy holidays when people walk away. And a lot of people, like probably 75% of the people, will uh, either 
they'll either say Merry Christmas back or like but it's the way they say it it's you know they'll say Merry Christmas like why are you saying happy holidays you should say Merry Christmas what's wrong you know and I, and I know a lot of people who get really mad about being too PC and um, like they'll say like when you say happy holidays they get mad because they're like it's Christmas why are you saying happy holidays and they just they don't understand that yes it's Christmas for you but it's something else for other people and that we shouldn't leave them out just because you celebrate Christmas and maybe the majority around here does celebrate Christmas we shouldn't leave the other people out and that really really bothers me because people get upset about it and it's a positive thing to say happy holidays is a good thing to say I mean you know it's I'm trying not to leave anyone out I'm not trying to take away from their Christmas wishes when people say Merry Christmas to me it's not like I'm gonna correct them and say oh no I don't celebrate Christmas because I hope they have a Merry Christmas and you know even even if I didn't celebrate Christmas, I mean, I hope they have a Merry Christmas, and even, I look at it this way, even if you don't celebrate Yule, or other religion, or other uh, holidays, I mean, you, I still want you to have a good Yule, you know, the 21st, the solstice, I want you to have a good day that day, the same as I want you to have a Merry Christmas, so when I say Happy Holidays, I want all those holidays to be good for you, whether you celebrate them or not, you know, it's really, no other, no different than saying have a good day, or just saying have a good day on this day. But anyway, I'm trying not to rant. Um, but like I said before, I am going to celebrate Christmas because my family celebrates Christmas, and I definitely want to spend time with them and you know be surrounded by that good energy and the spirits and everything. And um, I am exchanging presents. You know, it it would be the same thing if we all celebrated Yule. I would, I would give them the same presents, we would spend the same amount of time together, we would put up a tree and we would be happy together. So I don't really see the big deal of saying Merry Christmas, because I want you to have a Merry Christmas just the same as I want um, you to want me to have a, mer a Merry Yule, or a Happy Solstice. I don't know, I think I'm kind of ranting at this point, even though I'm trying not to. But, that's my video response. Clara, I definitely agree with you, I have a hard time with leaving... Christianity behind, not in the religious aspect, but in the the holidays and the people around me aspect, if that makes sense. Um, especially the music. I will be so. I'm probably going to continue using Christmas songs for the rest of my life because they're just some of my favorite songs, and I just I love, them. <laughs> I love Christmas carols. But anyway, um, if anyone has anything to say about that, then comment, link me other videos, video responses, whatever you want to do, and um, I look forward to hearing from you. Other than that, I'll see you next time, and blessed be.